got my thinking. My whiteboard's here. Okay, I'm gonna bring this to my classroom. Pardon the limp. I had an incident in January 2021. Uh, I'll tell you about that later. Uh, I'm excited to put this in my new classroom. All right, time to go to my classroom back here. Welcome to combo class. All right, now that we're starting up combo class, better establish some classroom rules. Rule number one, we're gonna go with attendance is optional. You don't have to come to all the videos, don't have to watch all the lectures if you want. Maybe you like the math stuff more, or the science stuff more, or the music or whatever. So come to whatever classes you want. Rule number two, let's talk about dress code. There's gonna be no dress code. You can wear whatever you want. I mean, if we meet up in person, maybe don't come fully naked, but no dress code when you're watching my videos. Rule number three is gonna be to be skeptical of all rules. You gotta be careful which rules you follow and believe. Rule number four is that you gotta respect the classroom chicken. I think that there should be animals in more places. You know, doctors' waiting rooms would be a lot better if we had cats. This chicken, whoa, there's a little bug on him, look. That's an unexpected visitor. This chicken is gonna have to do because I don't think a live chicken would have too much fun in this set right now. Maybe in grade negative two, I'll get some real chickens. For now, this ceramic one will have to do. And here we got a classroom clock. Now this one doesn't have any batteries, but that's actually kind of better. If it had batteries, I would have to figure out what time it was, try and set it to that, and it would always be like a millisecond fast or a millisecond slow. Here with a stopped clock, we'll be exactly right twice a day. In fact, it's exactly on time more often than all your clocks trying to be accurate. And if it was running backwards, it would actually be right four times a day. But for now, a stopped clock twice a day will have to do. And in fact, if I had some more stopped clocks, you know, one of them would be right more often during the day. If I had enough of these stopped things, we'd have one right every hour. Uh, yeah, all right, that sets up our clock situation. Now we'll have one right all the time. And if I ever need to know what the exact time at any given moment is, I can just take a field trip to the sundial. All right, thanks for helping me set up my combo classroom. I'll be your teacher, Demotro, for grade negative one. I thought that after my field studies with math and science and animals and plants and music and all sorts of wonders in the world, I thought I needed to share some of that with you guys. Sometimes learning is hidden behind the way that schools make you digest knowledge, but I think that some of the beautiful wonders of science are out there just waiting to be explored. So I wanna share some cool tricks on my sleeve. Okay, not that type of trick up my sleeve, I meant metaphorically. Oh my dice, damn, oh damn it. Okay, uh, okay, uh, I gotta clean up my dice, but I'll see you guys next time. We're gonna learn some cool stuff. Damn it.